You know what, Aaron? Go on. I'm kind of feeling an explosive pre-workout today. I'm after some PRs in the gym. I've actually got something just for that. What? Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, um, big thank you for joining us again on yet another pre-workout episode with us, the Review Bros. Um, today we do actually have the Tom Stoltman pre-workout called Boom. Now this does look like a good one, so do stay tuned for it. Again, this is from Proform Nutrition Subs. Uh, we'll put a link in the description below for where you can get this, but you know, a big thank you to them and Tom Stoltman obviously for getting this down for review. Exciting times. So. All right, it's tasty time. And this comes in bubble burst flavor, which is the only flavor, which is obviously the flavor we have. Obviously. Obviously. Um, so we're obviously presuming this is gonna be like a bubble gum flavor, you know, bubble burst. Oh, it smells lovely as well, just right off the bat. Mm, I've got an exact, exact uh, comparison to make for you guys out there, for the right. smell at least. Let's just wait for that flavour and I'll hit you up with that one. <laughs> Bang. I can't wait to drink it already just based on the smell. It literally is that nice. I haven't got the clearest see-through shaker today, but mm. it's more like, to be fair, it is actually that sort of colour in the in this as well. It's like a greeny blue. Yeah. Uh, the mixability looks to be very good. Yeah, respectable. We'll find out when we get down the bottom. But uh, let's go for it. Boom. Oh, so good. Mm. That is solidly good, isn't it? Mm, I really like that. The first thing we said to each other is, Jesus, that's nice. Do you remember what we said it was like, though? It's Hubba Bubba or something like no. that. It's, a, it's that yellow... Juicy thing. fruit. That's the one. You know the um, the little packet yellow chewing gum that you used to get? Mm, that tastes nice for five seconds and then the flavour goes. But these, obviously, the flavour keeps going. Yeah. <laughs> I'd give that a really good score. I'd go straight for a five, I reckon. I think the mixability is fantastic as well. Yeah, now that we've so, got it. So, yeah, I would, I would argue it is going to be very hard to beat this mm. as a tasting pre-workout. So, yeah, I, I'm very happy to go for a five out of five. And just to give you guys a frame of reference, we've only ever given one other five out of five before, and that's the Superhuman Hulk Juice, which is equally nice. So, you know, we don't go dishing out fires for no reason. Not at all. So, you know, that's a great start from Boom. <laughs> It is money time with this Tom Stoltman Pre. Now, obviously, we're talking from the Proform Nutrition website. Um, that's the main distributor of this product. Indeed. And that's the one we'll be going by because this is where we got it from. Um, start us off. So how much does this shiny tub set you back? You might be asking. Mm -hmm. Well, it's £37.99 UK pounds or £47.55 US dollar. So automatically off the bat, it is a more expensive slash premium product. Mm. Um, don't get me wrong, there is more expensive out there, but this is yeah. definitely on the upper echelon of straight up costs with pre-workout. Mm. And that unfortunately also is for 25 servings, not 30. Mm. Now that is 25 full servings, it's one full scoop. Um, so you might be asking, again, you might be asking, um, how much that works out per serving. Now, that works out to be one pound and 51 pence a go, or um, $1.89 a go. Now that is a very unlucky price. The reason being, it actually misses out on a three out of five by one pence, and it falls into a two out of five bracket. Um, so do bear that in mind that it does only just miss that three by a penny, mm. but as you can see, it obviously is a bit more expensive than an average pre-workout we'd like to review here. Yeah. Um, let's just see if those ingredients are worth the price. Let's see if the effects are worth the price. Um, I can tell you the taste was obviously worth, oh, worth yeah. the price. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's the price straight up for you guys there. All right, it's shiny label time, right? It is shiny label time indeed. Let's see what we got in this for £37.99. 
Sweet. So it's a 20 gram scoop, so which is nice. That's a solid grammage, so they're not holding back there. Big scoop. Um, first up, citrulline malate, two to one ratio, six grams. A nice dose straight off the bat, you're gonna be getting four grams of pure L-citrulline um, with the two grams of the malic acid. Now, um, that's been shown to improve pumps, um, and four grams of pure L-citrulline is a very nice mm. dose indeed. Um, it boosts nitric oxide levels in the bloodstream. That's that's actually one of the um, one of the main pump ingredients you'll find in any pre-workout when it comes to pump. Yeah. Um, so it's a good foundation pump product. Absolutely. That brings us on to another ingredient we like: beta alanine at four grams. Boom! That is a huge dose of beta alanine. So if you like your beta tingles, your beta riches, this is going to be one for you definitely. Um, we we used to see in pre-workouts with about two and a half to three point two grams to be exact. Yeah. Uh, three point two for some reason always has been the clinical dosage. Mm -hmm. So we've got another um, point eight of a gram on that. So we are getting a solid dose of that, and that also helps boost um, endurance in the gym um, by buffering the lactic acid. So um, you're going to get a couple more reps. Going to keep you going. Awesome. So that higher dose is going to basically increase the, the saturation rate uh, with continued use. Exactly that. Betaine and Hydrus, 3.5 grams. Betaine and Hydrus is, is a very good ingredient, and the reason it's very good is it's used for a multitude of um, reasons. It boosts endurance, it boosts um, power the output, immune system, immune system blood flow. Just so bits. many different bits and pieces. So. Um, we're starting to see it a lot more and more. And how much have we got again? 3.5 grams. That is a huge dose and all, like really huge actually. Mm. I think we're used to seeing like one to two grams. Yeah, you're right. So you, you're starting to see where the money is going now with this pre-workout. Yeah, we're getting so, well, so far solid dosages. Mm. Uh, that brings us on to another really well dosed uh, ingredient, taurine at two grams. Cool. That is a huge dose. We're used to seeing 500 milligrams to a gram. Yeah. Um, that's obviously used for um, energy, endurance, um, you know, power output. There's just a mul again, uh, similar to betaine actually, mm. a multitude of different um, properties that come from this ingredient. Brain function, blood flow. I mean, it's something you see a lot of the time in, in like energy drinks such as Red Bull and Monster, but yeah. obviously at a much lower dose than this. Mm. Good to see. Lovely jubbly. That brings us on to Acetel L tyrosine, 1.5 grams, which again was a pretty respectable. How dose. much? 1.5. Oh, that's <laughs> above average, I'd yeah, say. Yeah, very good dose. Um, that is used for uh, brain function. It's a nootropic. It's going to get you focus, concentration, coordination, tunnel vision. Um, I must mention that also the N Acetel version is a more bioavailable form in the body. So it digests better, therefore the body can use it better and more what it's for. Um, that's an amazing dose of that. You normally see L-tyrosine at that dose on, on it without it being in acetyl. Yeah. Solid dosages so far. They're throwing it all into this one. They're making sure they get the doses in you. Mm. Um, right, next up is Alpha GPC 800 milligrams, which looks to be another good dose. Yeah, another good dose we're used to seeing 300 to 500, yeah. mm. 800 again. Um, it's again another ingredient that's going to be used for focus, for brain boosting properties, um, just get that central nervous system firing. Um, a lot of these ingredients seem to be very much focused, which is something I'll mention at the end of why these ingredients have been put in this way. Mm. Okay, now we get into the uh, interesting stuff that's more energy related and starting with Juglans Whole Fruit Walnut 350 milligrams. Nice dose. Um, so we used to, obviously back in the very early days of pre-workout life, have the DMAA, which was the illegal stimulant, and that, well, not at the time, but obviously over the years it's been banned, and that had similar effects to some illicit substances. Now that soon transpired into DMHA, which again had similar effects to that. Um, the lab-based ones, however, started to get pulled and banned. Um, due to their synthetic capacity, you know, it wasn't it wasn't deemed healthy by the FDA. Now we're looking for natural variations of a very similar thing in the in the well in the wild, really. Mm. And what better than uh, Juglans Regia from the walnut tree? Now we'll say that is uh, going to be responsible for spikes, and I mean spikes in energy output, power output, brain function, 
and several other things, but it's a very good ingredient to have. Um, I'll say Juggling's Reeves is only a recent sort of discovery in the pre-workout world, yeah. um, and in such that more and more companies are starting to use it. I will say that's a good dose. Yeah, it might even be the highest dose we've seen, potentially, or at least up there. It's hard to say unless we really trawl through the mm. archives, but I can tell you that is a very good dose. Yeah, it's going to get things moving for sure. Um, matching that dose, uh, another 350 milligrams is the Foundation Stim Caffeine and Hydrus. Very nice dose, very nice dose. Um, you know, not too high that you can't focus with it. Definitely not too low that you don't have don't have that kick you need. Yeah. Um, you know, that is a main main stimulant of every pre workout there is that's stimulant based. Reason being, it obviously starts working within the brain to give energy boosting. Uh, properties in the body um, you know you know everyone has their coffee in the morning that's their kick mm. this is 3.5 times that kick it's gonna kick you right average. up the ass <laughs> yeah good dose all right um, just before I mention the last ingredient on the main label it's worth just noting that there's got vitamin C B6 and B12 in there so that's good to know um, and astrogen at 50 milligrams is the last ingredient astrogen a patented version of a digestive ingredient um, is obviously um, a more advanced version of black pepper extract or bioprene as you might know it. Um, now what that does is obviously we've got quite an extensive and a very well dosed list beforehand. Um, it's going to help digest that all within the digestive system um, to really make the most of those ingredients and make sure they're in the bloodstream, in the body, fully working before you start training. So mm. estrogen we like seeing. 50 milligrams I would say is the normal dose. Yeah. Um, so good to see it there. And it's solid AF that the doses are already good and then they've gone and thrown in a really good digestive aid to boost that even more. So exactly. it's like, Jesus. Now what we're, um, obviously that as, as Craig said, did sum up the label. Mm. What we've noticed is a very much a pattern towards powerlifting slash strongman mm. in that they're, um, they've are they not really gone all out in pump ingredients. In mm. fact, the only real one in there is the citrulline malate, mm. a good dose. Blood but. Flow. The um, energy from the caffeine and jugglers is going to be enough to really keep you going. Yeah. Um, and obviously, we're looking at three to four nootropic ingredients for brain boost and focus. Um, so we see that it is an energy slash focus pre. That is a, for a target audience of those powerlifters, strong men, um, that sort of audience. Very rightly so, considering it is from someone who competes in World's Strongest Man. Yeah, and we also do respect pre workouts. Um, we like the elements of stim and focus above pump because like we say time and time again you can get pump from your diet and other things in life so um, so um that you like it sums up labor doesn't it yep that's it so boom let's just see how this goes in the effects boom your turn <laughs> did you boom today's session we did boom the session indeed <laughs> 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 um, shoulder day yeah. and we have used it a few times as well important to note very important to note um, so obviously you know it's the bit you're waiting for it's how we honestly felt this in the in the gym sessions we've had with it um, and I'd like to say it's been very consistent above all uh, yeah. all the sessions we've had you know we've not had any weaknesses from it or any days where it was inconsistent from the rest it's a nice daily very nice daily you know the taste is amazing um, what we did say is it's comparable to another pre-workout you guys might be familiar with, which is Strom's pre-workout. And the reason we really do mention that in uh, in such a way is simply because these are UK brands. They are restricted, obviously, by the UK regulations. And they are very similar in effects, and they're very similar in... Um, in a sense, we've also used them quite close together. Yeah. So what we what we both have argued um, is that the beta alanine tingles and effect are much better with this one than the strong one. Yeah. And it obviously, you know, it holds true in that it is a higher dose of yeah. beta alanine. Same goes for the uh, L tyrosine is a higher dose. What we did <laughs> discuss is that. We think that energy is nice level, um, you know, you don't crash, there's no peaks and troughs again, like we always say. Pumps are probably its lowest performing thing for obvious reasons, it's it's going for the audience of powerlifters yep. and strong men. so they're not aiming for that pump, they mm. want you to get those PRs, those powerlifters, you know, the deadlifts, the squatters and all the rest of it. The focus elements are key here, and they are, they were good. They were very good. Um, so they, for me, the obviously the focus was its best element. Mm. Yeah, I'd agree. Um, followed by the energy mm -hmm. 
and then finishing off with the pump. Uh, like I say, the beat running was very good. The focus effects were very good. Yeah, you stay dialed in the whole time. And it's not a high though. It's not a no, higher feeling. It's more like a get shit done, dialed into your training brain, a uh, mind to muscle connection. Um, it's it wouldn't be suitable for a stim junkie. No, I wouldn't say my energy levels were. were high to very high i'd say they were good yeah and no rapid heart rate it's a productive pre-workout definitely you can tell it is aimed for uh strength training and like right quite like rightly so we did go quite heavy today didn't we and we enjoyed it and we were mm. explosive and we were getting close to pbs um that we haven't touched in a long time so um so we do have a number in mind for for its overall effects um, nothing was stand out um, the, the like, other than the focus and the beat running tingles, mm. they were they were definitely above average. They're the key things to mention here. The number in my mind is a four point two five out of five. Very much the same as Strong Black Edition. Um, I would ever slow slightly argue I prefer this just simply because the dosages are very solid. And it is a 20 gram scoop. And we love betralanine. And but, we get more tingling. Yeah. And definitely. the focus element was a little bit better in this one. Slightly. For slightly so much that it's probably still not quite a four, a four and a half To justify out of five. A, a whole, you know, jump up of pointage. We like this pre-workout. It's suitable for a daily driver. It's very obviously suitable for a powerlifter or yeah. um, a strong man. It's not suitable for a stim junkie. I'd argue it's not really suitable for a bodybuilder because it doesn't have those pump ingredients mm. or any builder ingredients. Not unless money isn't an issue and you're stacking it with a pump formula or you're just simply not interested in pump. That being said, I have heard rumours on the grapevine there is a Tom Stolten Boom 2.0 coming out. How the true that is, I can't be honest and tell you. It's just, where, you know, there's no smoke without fire and we've heard <laughs> that. So we will see. But yeah, that sums it up, a 4.25 out of 5 on the effects of this pre-workout. Final a verdict. On this boom pre-workout by Tom Stoltman. First up was taste. Taste, we really, really, really did like the taste. Mm. Um, you know, we, we um, really, really put it to the same flavour as the... Um, Juicy, juicy fruits, fruits. <laughs> uh, chewing gums, if you yeah. remember in the yellow packets. Oh, so good. Um, we gave it a five out of five. We really did like this flavour. However, it may not suit everyone. Yeah. If you like juicy fruits, five out of five for you. Yeah. If you don't, zero out of five for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, taste is something that is very, very much... Discretionary. Um, yeah, discretional to user. The price of the product was, it was very unlucky. It was unlucky because it was one pound and 51 pence a scoop. It missed out by one P of mm -hmm. a three out of five. So if you can find this any cheaper or get a discount code or, you know, any, you know, even get it that penny cheaper, it'll get that point more. Yeah. However, as things have to stand, they have to stand firm. We gave that a two out of five. Mm. on price so yeah a little bit more expensive than your average but effects do justify it they do which moves us on to the effects which got a 4.25 out of 5 <laughs> for the um the reasons mentioned in that effects section mm. yeah and that gives us a total overall score of 11.25 out of 5 and um you Only know. coming down on price. I mean, it's it's really smashed the other two elements. Yeah, it's a shame about the price. It is a bit more than an average. Well, it's definitely more than an average pre-workout. Put it that way. Mm. Um, and again, a big thank you to Proform Nutrition for sending this down, and Tom Stoltman himself, obviously. Um, and a big thank you to you lot who are watching along. Yeah, I mean, if it wasn't for you guys, we wouldn't even be here in the first place. So please do keep supporting us and we will support you with reviews on the daily almost. On the daily. <laughs> let us know if you've used this. Um, let us know your thoughts and feelings on it. Um, as always, we're very open to um, suggestions of what you want us to get reviewed Definitely. on this channel. Um, you know, it's just it's just all our love and um, happiness towards you guys for following along. Do subscribe if you can. Give us a thumbs up if you can. Um, can't thank you enough. Um, just let us know if you've tried it as well. We'll get a bit of a discussion going or any similar pre-workouts. Do you like powerlifter style ones or do you prefer bodybuilding aimed ones? As always, guys. Stay. Stimmed. Boom.